Hey, I'm a boy. Is it a nice evening to start off Father's Day weekend? It is sunny. It is warm. The Toledo night market kicking off one of many events that last year was canceled because of COVID this year back in action. We got live music and I wish smell a vision was a thing because those smells. Oh my goodness. There's pretzels, burgers, and we saw a guy walking with some snow cones earlier. That's a great way to cool off on a warm day like today, and it's going to be a warm and muggy Father's Day weekend and some clouds starting to bubble up, but nothing that'll rain on your parade this evening for those Saturday night plans. Our fifth third bank camera showing you some cloud cover, but also some peaks of sunshine and some blue in the sky. I want to show you first alert Doppler. There are some showers and thunderstorms bubbling up mainly to our north up towards Lansing, up towards Detroit, even into eastern Ohio and Cleveland, but northwest Ohio and southeastern Michigan has kind of lucked out as far as the rain and thunder goes. Panning out the view, you can see the rain and thunder to the northeast of us, but really dry conditions expected. There is a slim chance for a pop up shower, but I think most of the evening is going to stay totally dry for Father's Day weekend. Our hour by hour forecast does show you a slim chance for a pop up shower this evening. Might want to pack the umbrella if you are here at the Toledo night market, which goes till 11 p.m. tonight. So there is a str straight chance for a shower or two. Most of the evening is going to stay totally dry, though. I do want to talk temperatures for Father's Day weekend, even though the hour by hour forecast does show you a straight shower or two. The warmth and the humidity going to be the big story for Father's Day. In fact, I'm forecasting a high of 90 degrees tomorrow. Whether you're out grilling, golfing, or just relaxing on the patio with dad, it is going to be a warm summer feeling day. It's also going to be fairly humid and totally dry, so you don't have to worry about any rain or thunder on Father's Day. Just looking at those very warm weather conditions and kind of an interesting comparison Father's Day versus Mother's Day. Well, it was snowing on Mother's Day. Sorry, moms. It was cold rain and snow mixing in. And meanwhile, Father's Day is going to be 90 degrees and sunny. So I think I have an idea which one you like better, but Father's Day is certainly going to feel and look like summer. My first alert 10 day forecast, another hot and humid one tomorrow. Our next chance for rain and thunderstorms, that's going to roll in Sunday night into Monday. A stronger cold front's going to sweep on through, could spark some thunderstorms, and you might wake up to some rain and booming thunder Monday morning. But behind that cold front, look what happens to our temperatures. We're down into the 70s through midweek with sunshine returning, bringing some relief from the heat and the humidity. We do warm up a little bit towards the end of that 10 day forecast, but sure good to see that nice weather here for the weekend. And if you do like it cooler, I think you'll like the looks of Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, bright sunshine, cooler days on tap with that relief from the humidity as well behind the cold front. Just a reminder to get that first alert weather app with a straight chance for a pop up shower. It never hurts to check radar before you head out.